What's up guys? It's K6Scope, we're back with more Pokemon White. In the last episode, what did we do? Well, we heard some speech from some weird dude named Getsis, and then we battled this other guy, who was also talking about liberating Pokemon named N. However, I was pretty sure I saw him throw his Purloin out of a Pokeball, so, um, little pot calling the kettle black there? Yeah. Oh look, it's a little preview of the next route, and some free items. Beautiful scenery and relaxing sounds. You gonna jizz over this uh, wall here, man? Oh man, I sure do love this place. Sure makes me feel happy. Well, I mean, good for you, man. Oh look, it's a little house on the hills. It's a Mincino! Chip Quip! Why does it say Chip Quip? What's up, chick? Shall I play my favorite tune? Yes. Hee <laughs> hee, please listen to my music. Whenever you talk to people that play instruments in this game there and you tell them to play it, their instruments actually add to the soundtrack, so if you listen, you'll hear piano added to it. It's very nice, so let's talk to the dude with the drums. Do you want to listen to my drum? Yes. My heart, as long as my heart beats. I will keep on, keep on drumming. Look at that, that's some jams right there. God, that, I can get down to that, man, oh my god. That's why, that's some of the cool things about this game, man. You gotta love it. Just doesn't get much better. <laughs> man, it's hard for me to even talk now. This is my jam. Number of Pokemon you can take with you one time is six. <laughs> drums just always add so much to music. I don't know what I'd do without drums. Yeah, I'll battle on Route 2. After I finish getting down and dirty, this is beat, yo. Hey, calm down, kid. I know, Pokemon can remember four moves at a time. Well, aren't you the bright one? Alright, what do you got in your trash? Nothing? God! Who does the janitorial services around here? Because they're amazing. Weak Pokemon, strong Pokemon, cool Pokemon, cute Pokemon. Many Pokemon look forward to meeting you. I know. Whoa! Holy ball sack. Oh man, now that I'm playing a OP in a real Pokemon game, I'm gonna... Well, training card game is a real Pokemon game, I guess. But, you know, I should be doing my Pikachu sneeze. I'll tell you guys what it is next time I sneeze. Wow, you have a great bag that can store anything. Why don't you buy lots of potions? Because I'm poor. You gotta have money to buy stuff, dude. You'll learn that soon enough once you move out of your mom's attic. Scrub. Sorry, I don't know why I was so mean to him. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Pokemon do everything in their power for people. People treat these Pokemon with love and affection. Yeah, exactly. See, those guys don't know what they were talking about. They're just cretins, I tell you. What's in this trash? Nothing. If you get strong, you can move forward. If you move forward, you'll be stronger. Yeah, it's like, I eat because I'm unhappy. I'm unhappy because I eat. Pokemon will be strong if you train them, even if they're weak now. Yeah, I suppose. When a hero leaves the world, Pokemon is going to come and help the hero. Everybody in the Inova region knows the legend. Really? Huh. Well, I want a legendary Pokemon, so all I've got to do is become a hero. It's a Pat Rat! Scree scree! Why do none of the Pokemon say their names anymore? This is a Pokeball I got in the past. I'm going to give it to you. Oh, hell yeah, free Pokeballs, man. FTW. Can't catch Pokemon if you don't have Pokeball. Yeah, well, unfortunately, the best one for the job isn't available. Oh my god, this guy's got two trash cans? Hell yeah. And they're both empty. Hell no. Hi, hi, let's play Pokemon Rock, Paper, Scissors. Okay. Oops, I didn't mean to do that. I just kind of mashed A. Your Pokemon is fire, and mine is water. Fire type is weak against water type. Basically, all this is doing is it's helping you learn type weaknesses. Shit, I keep mashing it. So, fire type is weak to grass, so I win. You basically pick between fire, water, and grass. Alright, so I'll pick water. And she picked grass, so she wins. There you go, so you can practice your weak... It only applies to the starter types. Trust me, I wish there were only three types in this game. It'd be a lot easier, but nope. There are a lot. There are 17 types, I think. But I'm not sure. Do 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 do. Oh, my epic music is gone. Good afternoon, trainer. This is a gate for travelers. Please check the electric bulletin board. Okay. So this thing's pretty cool. It pretty much just generates random information. Strident City is nestled in the forest, and the breeze smells like trees. Wow. You're a poet and you didn't know it. The stairs at the entrance help with heavy snow. Stratton Gym is a restaurant where meals and battles are served. Yeah, sometimes it'll give you other information too, like um, the weather and 
it's where swarms are of Pokemon and stuff. It's pretty cool. Watch the information changing on the electric bulletin board. It makes me happy. I find it so soothing. You know what? So do I. The trash can is empty. Damn it. Alright, welcome to Route 2. Yep, the leaves are gone. Oh, what's this? Who could it be? Hmm. What's up, mama? Um, yeah, things are good. I don't know why I have to constantly keep my hand on my hat. Maybe it will blow off. Maybe it's windy out here. Whoa, what the balls? Uh, hey. Hell yeah, you know me. Still the same OG back again for you, right? Yep, Stratton City. That is my destination. Oh, you got a present? Yes, the running shoes. We are now unstoppable. When you're wearing the running shoes, you can go anywhere in a flash. Uh, yeah. So the thing that sucks about this is for some reason, in Heart Gold and Soul Silver, they had the best idea ever, which is put the running shoes on the bottom screen as a button. When you click the button, you will start automatically, you will automatically run everywhere. When you click the button off, you won't run. It's that simple. And it was great because you didn't have to hold the B button every time you wanted to run. It was beautiful. It was like an auto run feature. But for some reason, they took that away now. And now all that happens is it's the same as it used to be. You have to hold the B button. I don't know why they took that feature away, but it pisses me off. Anyway, uh, this is a strength boulder right here. This is what they look like now. And now you don't just push them from side to side. Now what you have to do is push them in holes. And as you can see, there's an item over there. But battles between Pokemon trainers are serious affairs you can't run from. Oh, really, fool? Well, there are also items here. It's a potion! Something else they also brought back in this game is fake items. They'll look like items in the grass. But sometimes they won't be. They did that in the first gen in like, um... They only did it in the power plant, I think, though, where items were actually Voltorbs and stuff like that. So it's pretty cool. Anyway, as for Pokemon on this route, um... Same Pokemon as before, Pat Rat and Lillipup, except you can now find Purloins, which is that Pokemon that N had. So if you want to catch that scrub, go ahead. Um, it's pretty much... It evolves into this Lipard, which is a Dark type. So it's kind of like Pur Ugly from the last gen. And it's pre evolvement was it Skitty? No, I don't I don't know. Alright, Lillipup, you're going down. I don't really want to waste my energy on you because there are trainers here, but whatever. Odor Sleuth? No, please, don't identify my odor. You know what would be so funny? You know what I would train my tr starter to do? If somebody uses Odor Sleuth on me, I would train him to fart right when they use Odor Sleuth. So that he'd be like, <laughs> and then I fart, and then he's like, oh shit, and then he like faints. Dude, that would be awesome. Or he becomes confused, you know, some status ailment, he falls asleep, I don't know. It'd be a status ailment called Disgusted, and he just, he would be, it would be like Paralyzation, Sleep, and Poison all put together. It'd be the best status ailment ever. It's funny, because there's actually a Pokemon in this game that would very well utilize that, and it would seem perfect for him. Okay, guess what time it is? First trainer battle, except for the one against N, but whatever. And Bianca and Shren. Trying to catch as another strain as I. This is the start of a Pokemon battle. But I didn't catch your eye. You caught my eye. Or no. You I caught your eye. You didn't catch my eye. I was just looking straight forward. You walked up to me. I didn't make eye contact. Therefore, it should not have to happen. Well, I guess I looked at you, but I'm playing the game. I'm not the character. Well, I guess in theory I am. If you control the character, you are the character. Man, it's cool. Like, I'm playing this on my headphones, and this thing has, like, surround sound. It's, like, going in both ears. It's really cool. I wonder how it picks it up on the game. I should definitely listen to that when I'm editing. Hey, Future Scope editing this. Listen to it and see if it, like, sounds different. See if it's picking up everything. If it's not, oh well. If it is, cool beans. Boop. Youngster Jimmy, youngster Jimmy. What? You are too strong. Dude, all you had is a pat rat. Did you really honestly expect to be any good? What's up, kid? Hey, you! I'm gonna do something amazing. Wanna watch? Sure. Okay, wait one second. Don't try this at home, kids. Oh, what a beast. Hey, were you watching? No, I missed it. Can you come do it again? Okay, you can jump over ledges. Great. Uh, what's up? Do you wanna fight? I don't think so, because you're facing... Yeah, you're facing the tree. Walk on the road. Pokemon only appear in tall grass. Wow, what a genius. Okay, yeah, cool. Oh! By the way, don't worry, I'm not going to be doing this like some loser run where I only use my main Pokemon. Just We haven't run into any good ones yet, but the first Pokemon we can catch 
um, that I'm going to put on my team will be coming pretty soon. Oh man, speaking of that, I need to start thinking of nicknames. Holy crap. But I'll do it. It'll be soon. I don't know if it'll be before the first gym or not. Maybe. I probably could make it before the first gym if I wanted to. Look, it's Purloin level 7. Same thing Ann had. Die. Oh man, have I even been using my running shoes that I got? Those things are so good. Alright, water gun your face. Eat that, bitch. Oh yeah, Noki's level 10. Oh, my phone's ringing. Hold the phone. And we're back. Look at that. One plus one to everything, two to HP. That's pretty crap, actually. But, you know, you're only level 10. What do you expect? Oh, uh, sorry. I was just kind of walking into your face there. Okay, look at this. Now we can run! I believe I can run. Yeah. It's a Lillipup! Get it? Because it's like Lollipop, almost. You just replace the I's and the U's with O's. I won't always fight all wild Pokemon. Just right now, the experience is very easy. But eventually, wild Pokemon, the experience will become so negligible from them that it's just not worth it. And that actually comes really quickly, that point, so... Repels might want to be something you're going to want to start investing in pretty damn soon here. It's a Purloin! That's funny, because loin is like, you know, your groin. I don't know. Let's just tackle. I don't have much water guns left, and I'm really not sure how many more trainers are here. Oh, look at that. Good call. Good call. Quick win. Alright, this is going to be a trainer. Show enough. Come on, little boy. Backwards hat versus forwards hat. I like just spoiling which Pokemon you have, scrub. Dude, did I change my battle speed set to, or the tech speed to fast? I don't think I did. <sighs> it's a wild Lillipup! Um. I oh know it's not wild, this is a trainer. Holy crap. I gotta stop that, man. Sleuth in my odor. <laughs> Oh god. That really needs to be a thing. Cool thing about Oshawott too is sometimes you'll see him like holding his little he's got a little seashell on his stomach and sometimes he'll grab it and like hold it. It's pretty cool. Oh there he goes right now, he's holding it. Oh no he wasn't. It looked like he was. Look at that, level eleven. Oh yeah. Well maybe he only does that in water sport, that's shit. Maybe he only does that in uh black and white too. I know in white too he does it, but I don't know if he does it in this one. That's unfortunate. Uh, so what do we got here? Route 2, yes. Um, also, we've got a cut tree here. This tree looks like it can be cut down. And more items, of course. There's a hill there with nothing interesting going on. First burp! Okay, what's going on up here? Oh, these are those two items we saw from Akimiola Town sitting on the thing. It's a poche. Two items right next to each other. Too good to be true, I know, right? Oh, look, the grass does have that effect here. Man, I made a liar out of myself. Well, that's okay, because I'm happy about that. Alright, so, um... Oh, no! Oh, hi, Scope! No, Bianca! How'd you see me from over there? Hey, listen! Look, Hey, listen! Let's have a Pokemon battle! Please, the Pokemon I cut have become a little stronger! Ready or not, here I come! Big mistake, pal. Ba-da-da-da-la-la-la-la-la! Alright, she can barely pull the Pokemon out of her bag. Scrub status. How does she not get robbed on these routes, man? Alright, so she's got a level 6. Oh my god, my Oshawats is gonna die. So Water Sport, what it does, if you hold L and press the button, it'll tell you what the attack does, which is pretty cool. Soaks itself with water, weakens fire-type moves. So, if that's your cup of tea, then sip it up. Well, that's not mine. Oh, fucking own. That wasn't even a crit, dude. It's to pig. I'm not even gonna... Okay, the little one is up next. I'm not even gonna heal for this, because I will kick his ass. Look at that, now that I've got your weakness, bub. You just got... You just got swept, Bianca. That's just what happened there. You lose. Oh, I couldn't win. That's right, you couldn't. Your to pig has only grown two levels. What the hell happened? 
You are a tough cookie, Scope. I'm gonna work hard on training my Pokemon so we won't lose anymore. Okay, I see that happening. <laughs> so she goes back. We're not like right next to the town where you can go heal or anything. What a scrub. Anyway, welcome to Striatin City. Yeah. So this place is pretty big. We got a lot of exploring to do here. A lot of shit happening. I wonder if they'll let me leave. <gasps> a trash can. And it's empty. Damn it. Every once in a while. Every once in a while they'll have something. All right, hell yeah, let's heal. This way we won't have to waste any posts. Yeah, restore my Pokemans, please. Because I've got work to do. <laughs> so fast when you only have one Pokemon. That's hilarious. Um, yeah, okay. You might always want... Well, not... You not might... Oh my god. Dyslexia much? You always want to talk to the people in the Pokemon centers. Sometimes they'll actually be very important people. Just the ones that are, like, randomly sitting around. Have you been catching Pokemon? Okay. Like, you know, pal. Man, that wall glitches out like crazy. Okay, so, uh... Oh, this looks like the gym. Stratton City Pokemon Gym. Leader, blank, blank, blank. Triple trouble. Okay, triple hyphen. Yeah, that's pretty scary. Are you looking for the gym leader? He is not here. He could be in the trainer school. If you want to challenge him, please go find him. The trainer school is not far from this gym. Oh, really, fool? Hmm. Interesting. Um, I want to kind of see. This is the trainer school, by the way. I want to see how far they'll let me go before I leave. This guy will probably stop me. Yep. Go figure. You don't seem to have any gym badges. With your lack of experience, you have a hard time in the future. Here's some friendly advice. Challenge the gym leader in this town and test your ability. Who are you to stop me, man, from traveling? That's like if you try to go out of town for a weekend and somebody's like, Oh, you haven't visited the fucking movie theater yet. You should probably do that and get some more experience under your belt before you go drive out of town. It's like, no, you would punch that person in the face for saying such a ridiculous thing. All right, let's check out some of these skyscraper thingies. Um... Oh, hey, our first grape ball already. Great. <laughs> no pun it. I really didn't mean to make that joke. And trash can is empty. Okay. Fine. Fine. I'll get into my relationship with my wife was our Pokemon battles. Oh, she was kicking your ass, man. My husband and I are compatible because he cannot beat me in battle. Oh, so that makes her a good husband, huh? Who is texting me? Lord. Text you back, man. I'm playing Pokemon. Ah, uh, it's always empty, isn't it? Your family must be talking about you right now. Oh, well, I've only got a mom. Sorry. Oh, well, that's cool. Do your Pokemon have nicknames? Uh, yeah. I agree, actually. That you know that uh, that is kind of true. The more your Pokemon has a nickname, I guess the more attached you feel to it. Kind of like your kid. You name your kid. You just named him Kid. I wouldn't be that attached to him, would you? After a battle, to my surprise, my Pokemon evolved and changed its appearance. You don't say. Some evolve and some don't. Pokemon really are mysterious creatures. Uh, let me go upstairs. You can't go upstairs now, because Fennel said she was testing something and she had a scary look on her face. Wait, Fennel, no. Professor Juniper said for me to... Man. You guys are blocking my plot progression. It's really upsetting me. Okay, what's up, kid? Moves power will increase. Yeah, it's called Stab. How convenient for a Pokemon game. No matter how often I challenge him, he always uses Pokemon that I don't like. Ah, that's like actually a clue of how the gym leader kind of runs. This place we call the Dream Yard, there's an unusual Pokemon that can make dreams appear. Whoa, no way. What type of Pokemon are we against? Grass type Pokemon. I know more stuff. Well, do you? That's just great. <gasps> hidden item, hidden item, hidden item. We gotta go get that. Gotta go get it. Gotta keep them separated. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Hell yeah. It's an X speed. Lovely. Just what I wanted to see. I don't think we can go in this building here yet. It doesn't have a door. That's quite unfortunate. What a waste of a building. What's going on, guys? What's up? Hey, let me talk to you. Lately, I have a favorite model. Her name is Alessa, and Pokemon are strong too. No, 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 no. We already talked, buddy. That's it. That's it for me and you. We're done. Our relationship is over. Yes, everybody here is fascinated with gym leaders. Uh, yeah. Global Trade Station. Holy hallelujah. No! 
Alright, what do you guys got going on upstairs? Dude, that pat rat is blocking me from the trash can. That's right. Exactly, yeah. That's why it's funny. That's why, see, this guy knows what I'm talking about. That's why it's so funny to me that all the gym leaders here are supposed to be really good trainers, the best of the best. Always use unitypes. They like, or they use dual type Pokemon, but they always use, like, every single one of their Pokemon is one type, at least. And it's pretty stupid. Like, come on. Get some diversity. Learn from some of the best leaders of all time. Blue. Whoops. Didn't mean to do that. I think Blue is the only multi-type gym leader. Huh. Well, son of a bitch. Uh, looks like we don't have anywhere else really to go here, except for the, um, I mean, the trainer school. What's up? Some trainers train themselves and their Pokemon in the Dream Yard. You might think about going there. Could be you'll find something. Ah, uh, maybe so. But first I've got to check out the trainer school. Whoops. Trainer school, brush up on Pokemon knowledge. Hell yeah. Don't really want to brush up on knowledge, I kind of just want to find the gym leader. Oh look, it's Sharen! What's up, buddy? When a Pokemon is poisoned, its HP decreases when it's battling. Hey, Scope, have you come looking for the gym leader? He was here talking about Pokemon types until just a few moments ago. Maybe you walked right past him. By the way, Scope, will you have a battle with me? I want to test how important items are in battles. Okay, fine. Let's see how effective my items are. Maybe I should test how well I can battle without items. This is an indoor match, so let's battle without getting too rough. Oh no, sorry, so you're asking me to hold back, Sharen? Big mistake, pal. Alright, come on, Alfalfa, throw it out. Oh, he's got two Pokemon now, too. Whoa. Whoa. What does he got? A Snivy. Ooh. We're gonna have a hard time dealing with this guy, seeing as how our only Pokemon is Noki, but... Definitely don't go for your Water-type movie, even though it has Stab. It's gonna... Oh, he's so gonna kill me. Oh wow, that's actually very weak. Moves that can never miss and moves that can attack first. There sure are a lot of different moves. Hell yeah. It's funny, there are so many priority moves now that a lot of them just kind of out-prioritize each other. Like, quick attack barely ever even goes first. Like, it's outclassed by so many. Oh, he had an Orin Berry. What a cheer. That's okay, dude. I think I'm pretty... Oh no, Vine Whip is physical. So that is smart on his part. But anyway, I think the fastest move, the highest priority move, is Extreme Speed. Because it even says in a description, this move goes first no matter what. Okay, now you're scaring me, dude. You might kill me in one hit here if I don't kill you right now. I would appreciate a critical. Ooh, you're stupid, dude. You are so stupid. If you would've used Vine Whip there, you probably could've killed me. But if he gets a Vine Whip off now, he'll definitely kill me. Too bad, you suck. But now my defense is basically shit. Purloin. Okay, definitely gonna want to water gun this thing. Yeah, yeah, Sharan, stop giving me a tutorial mid-battle. That's not nice. Okay, this Purloin might kill me. My defense is so low. Assist. That was stupid. Oh, no! No! Oh my god, that didn't kill me. Holy shit. I guess it's because he didn't have stab. Man, that was dangerous. Well, that's why you want to have more than one Pokemon on your team, guys. Thankfully, Sharen sucks, so we won. Yeah, buddy! I see! Losing you means that I still have a lot to learn. Sure it does, pal. So, learning to use items well is definitely important then. Oh, here, Scope, I'll give you these berries. Orange berries, those are nice. I mean, our Pokemon don't have anything else to hold in the meantime, so we might as well give this to him now. Yeah, basically, if their health goes in the yellow, they'll automatically eat this and restore 10 HP. So, I need to stop pressing start because X is the button that brings up the menu. Start don't do shit. Um, so we want to use gip. No, 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 not potions. Uh, Orin Berry, there we go. So, let's give one to Noki for now. And I could, you know, I could go heal at the Pokemon Center, but what the hell. Why not? It's also weird in this game, they put your balls in the same pocket as, like, your regular items, which is really annoying, because it's very difficult to sort them out. You know what, we could talk to these people before we end the episode, sure. Quiz about status conditions? You know what, sure. Oh, shit! I fucking was mashing the A button, but I got it right. Okay, cool. Oh, uh, which of the following Pokemon wakes up sleeping Pokemon? That would be Awakening. Um, okay, cool, we got a full heal. Those are actually pretty rare at this point in the game, but here's any status ailment. Yeah. Um, yeah, stop evolution, press B when the Pokemon is evolving. It's really cruel. 
Ah, abilities, yes. We'll learn more about those later when our Pokemon actually gets abilities that do stuff. Right now, Torrent just makes our water moves more powerful, but... Trash can is empty. Um, it makes it more powerful when you're weak. Yeah, another good thing about this game is they finally made it to where TMs are multi-use. So you can use TMs as many times as you want. So it's pretty nice. And a lot of uh, useless HMs like Flash and uh, Rock Smash, they turned into TMs. So now you can get those moves deleted off your Pokemon. You can still get HMs deleted at the move deleter, but um, it's not really, you know, a big deal. It's still annoying to have to do it. So, um, moves like Flash and stuff are really, it's really nice that it's a TM and that you can use TMs over and over again because basically if you want to teach somebody, if you need to use Flash in a cave, you can teach somebody Flash, get rid of a move that you have a TM of, use Flash, and then get rid of Flash and teach the TM of the previous move back to the Pokemon and Flash will be in effect still, so that's pretty cool. Anyway, this guy is the gym leader here, or one of them, or something. So, we're going to talk to him and figure out what's going on with this crazy gym leader dash 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 thing. And maybe he'll tell us about the dream yard too. But that's all going to happen in the next episode. So, look forward to that shit. I will be there when you see it. So, meet me there. Goodbye.